Hey YouTube, what's up? Terman5551 coming at you guys with another video. Um, today I'm gonna be showing you all my uh, new 90 gallon fish tank. Um, it's going to be a reef tank once everything gets um, settled. It's in the cycling process right now. So before I talk about what's in the tank, I'm just gonna go ahead and talk about what, like some of the, just about the tank. Um, up here. I have the marine land glass lids that come with the tank. And then I have a light here, which I don't know if you guys can see. It's kind of bright. Has um it has two. No, you can't really see it. I can see a little bit there. It has uh two actinics right here, 24 inches a piece all the way down, and two um 10k bulbs. 24 inches all the way down. It's hot. <laughs> and then, I'll show you the different lighting effects. This is just the 10K. That's the 10, that's with the uh, actinix, doesn't make much of a difference. That's just the actinix. And then, another cool feature about this like, light is there is four pairs. You can see one, two, three, four. Four pairs of blue moon LED lights that give the uh, tank its shimmer effect. And this is their night light um, for now. The reason there's more shimmer on this, I'll go into why there's more shimmer on this side than this side. Okay, go ahead and turn back on some lights. Okay, and then as far as filtration, I have the overflow box up there the in, with the outlet tubes. The overflow box which flows down to the um, Aquion Proflex sump, the Model 3. Flows down through this tubing under the tank, right back down through there. Then it flows into some uh, filter socks, as you can see there. Then behind this wooden post is like a refugium area, which I'm not going to use too much, but it will get used eventually for a protein skimmer and then in the final chamber it has the pump that pump is pumping up at about 485 gallons an hour um, back into the tank plus I have an 800 gallon an hour pump right there um, and then the reason the shimmer effect is brighter on that side than that side is because for one the, out the uh, outlet tubes are right there so it has more water flow up above and I have an 800 gallon pump on this side and not one on this side. I actually have one sitting right there, but um, the cord's not long enough, so I have to get a, another extension cord. And it's about and it's almost Christmas time, so most of our extension cords are being used for various things. Um, the thing I really like about this light is that it does have three different power cords, so you can control them all three. And I have a digital timer over here for that. Um, that has morning, night. Um, as far as food, I feed them frozen brine shrimp and these Omega-1 marine flakes with garlic. I have my testing kit right back down there. And then some pretty cool LED lights that have a little switch there. Okay, now I'll talk about the tank. Oh, um, I have an Aquion magnet scrubber, the medium sized, a Red Sea hydrometer that has something in it right now. Hmm, don't know what that is. Anyway, Red Sea hydrometer, it's reading about 1020, oh, oh, a little bit low, probably should bring it up a little bit more. And then a digital thermometer probe that is reading right now at. 77.2 and there's that okay now as far as what's in the tank some seashells from my trip to San Diego I have two pieces of live rock which is this one right here this one right here then I have three pieces of dry rock that that and that one back behind there this these are two different pieces I have a heater here, um, like I said, an 800 gallon in our pump. There will be another one on this side, 
but it just hasn't been hooked up yet. And then I have 60 pounds of dry sand. It's not live sand. I'm I'm going to get some more sand to put in because it is kind of shallow right now. Um, then, as far as the fish go, I have two yellow tails, which are those right there. I have two regular blues, which are those right there. And then I have a three stripe, which is that guy swimming by. And a four stripe, which is right there. Along with another one of my uh, blue damsels. So, that's my 90 ounce tank. Um, when everything's said and done, I hope to have a lot more live rock in here. And just went pecking at each other. Anyway, I hope to have a lot more live rock in here than what I have right now. But I think it looks pretty good. Um, for only being set up for like three weeks, I think. So, um, if you have any comments or tips, just let me know. Um, I'm new to this, so I've done a lot of research, but I'm still new. And I know a lot of you are going to say, that pump down there is not big enough. And, um, in some cases, yes, and I probably will be getting a bigger pump later on but for now it works fine pumps it up at a pretty good rate so so rate comment and subscribe to my videos and any tips will be really helpful um so yeah well see ya